Good morning, movers. Tracy Steen back with you for another cardio hit workout. I have a bit of a different format for you today. So first of all, I'm gonna give you 10 different exercises. Each one we're gonna repeat three times in a row before moving on to the next one. We're gonna do that whole list, and then at the very end, we're gonna to go to 60 seconds of each exercise with only 15 seconds in between. This was such a fun workout. I know that you're gonna have a great time. All you're gonna require is some water or BCAAs. Make sure you grab your towel, because it's getting sweaty in here. Okay, are you ready to move daily? Let's do it. Let's give me some arm circles with a little tap side to side, just like that. This is the first day all summer that it's been a little bit smoky outside. Switch directions. I live in the Okanagan and in the last number of years it's been actually called the Smokinagan because of all the forest fires. Okay, let's reach up here and up. That's it. So, this summer, well it's August 10th now, literally the first morning that I woke up to smell smoke in the air, which kind of sucks. I can actually feel it in my throat right now a little bit. Okay, bring it across right here. Good. But anyway, I suppose it had to happen sooner or later, unfortunately. But we have held off for most of the summer, so that's been good. Go for four, three, two, and one. All right, right here. Give me a little twist there as well. Okay, the glutes warmed up and those hip flexors. Oh, look forward, otherwise you're gonna get dizzy. Good job. 10 more. Six, five, four, three, two. Let's go to a squat, but I want you to come up to your tiptoes. Okay, reach up, uh, up above your head as well. We're gonna stretch those calves out as we'll be doing a lot of jumping and hopping today. So get those warmed up. One more there, good, take it wide. Right here, big stretch in the chest as well. We are throwing in I think it's just one exercise that includes push-ups. So that to me is also a cardio move as it gets my heart rate up for sure. Good. Okay, little butt kicks right here. Ten more. All right, take it wide. Last one right here, let's reach. Get those hamstrings starting to feel like they're warming up. Mine are very tight from a leg day this week. Oh, goodness. Did anyone do that super duper leg burner? Wow. That was cardio and uh, leg for sure. That was a burner for sure. All right, there we go. Good, good, last here, reach and Bring the knee up to the chest. Good. Ooh, yeah, my little heart's up. I feel like I'm breathing heavy already. Last five. Okay, last one right here. Good, make sure you have your water or BCAAs handy. Again, no equipment, just grab a towel because you're gonna need it. Okay, you're gonna start with a jack, elbow to knee. Okay, get ready. Let's do it. Here, good. So you've got this for three rounds, okay? Modify right here if you want a low impact. <clears throat> good. 30 seconds will go by fast, but again, just 10 seconds in between. Once we get in the middle of this, Workout, that's not gonna feel like a lot of time, is it? Get that knee up, bring it across, good. And break, if you don't need a break, feel free to jog it out just like this right now, or tap right like this for low impact. Here we go.
I like this exercise. It's not horrible. <laughs> not yet. Let's keep it going. Okay, rest or shuffle. Last round. Halfway, let's go. a good cardio starter here. Okay, a little break if you need here. Good, we're gonna go to some in and out jumps. So you can modify right here. Otherwise, we're jacking in and out. Here we go, stay low. Keep face the front if you can. Okay. This is gonna be a light burner. Might need to take that 10 seconds of break. Let's see how we do here. That's it. Get into that lower squat position. You should feel those hamstrings and glutes starting to fire up. Okay. Shuffle. More rest. <clears throat> Let's do it. Suddenly my cooler house does not feel so cool anymore. One gal messaged me from Australia, said it's winter there for them. And she was freezing and she was so happy. These workouts warmed her up. <laughs> uh-huh. Best. Get ready. Last one here. Whoo! Burn, burn. Okay, lateral lunge, hop. You're gonna lunge here, hop in the center, or you can squat in the center to modify. Whew, here we go. Here, here. Reach your hips way back. That's it. Reach. Okay, I'm resting for a sec. It's good. Here we go. About 10 seconds now is nothing, right? I don't know that works. That one leg super straight. No bend there. 
Woo, okay. Moving into a walk out, push up, squat jump at the top. So an inchworm push up. Here we go. Walk, 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 push up at the bottom. Modify from the knees, right here at the top. Big jump at the top. Make it explosive. Woo! That's it. Keep going. Okay. Little shuffle here. Two more rounds. Here we go. Moving into that four scissors, low shuffle, four scissors. Okay, you can tap back for four to modify in a low impact. Here we go. And one, two, three, four, low, low, low. That's it. Or modify here. Keep going. That's it, go, go. And one, two, three, four. Okay, rest. I took a little break, so I've got energy for this shuffle here. Let's hit it again. One, two, three, four. Ten. 
10 seconds. I feel all the water that I drank in my stomach right now. Sloshing. Okay. One more round. Here we go. One, two, four, low. Get your hands involved here. Boom. Like that. That's it. Okay, double front punch right here. Modify here. Three rounds of that coming up. Let's work. Boom. When your legs jack out, hands punch. If you find that too difficult, do it the opposite. A little bit easier. Whoops. <laughs> there it is. Oh, there was no music going. You hear my stomach sloshing. Too much water. And break. <clears throat> Here we go. Punch, punch. Good job. Right there. Otherwise, we're jumping it. Here we 
we go. Low. You want to pop up, bring your hands up, but stay in that low squat. Whoa, my quads. Nice wide jump. Uh, exterior of your hands. Wow, that was harder than I thought it would be. Okay, shake it out. Get ready for round two. Here we go. Flat back, shoulders back. of work with 15 seconds in between. No doubt I'll be taking my full 15 seconds. You're starting with that jack high knee. Modify if you need. This is gonna go by quick. 10 minutes of work right here. Let's work. Up. Okay, remember your modification here is just like that. Okay, so don't stop. If you have to modify, feel free. Listen to your body though, of course. As always. Okay, some of these are gonna be a challenge. Like the squat jumpy things and no bottom burpees, but it's 10 minutes, okay? Anyone can do anything for 10 minutes. Well, <laughs> maybe not anything, but it's really not that long. We'll do it. You're already halfway through this one. Let's go. Up. What's next? I didn't write out big enough, so now I gotta go over there, <laughs> sorry. And no jokes, coming up. Three. 
three, two, and rest. I'm resting. Feel free to shuffle. I'm not. So you get all that lactic acid or hydrogen as it is in the quads dissipated. Okay, low in and out jumps. Work here. Nice flat back, stay tall as you can, okay? Remember your mod for this is here. Center, squat, okay? Wow, I mean it's a long time. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Woo. It's okay. Just keep going at your own pace here. Okay. Oh yeah, lateral lunge, lateral hop. Coming up. Okay. Wait. This one's not horrible because you get a little reprieve with the lunge. But hop in the middle, squat in the middle, modify it. Okay, ready? Side lunge, reach, hop, reach, modify right here, squat. back. Oh, can I do this? Let's try it. I'll definitely have to modify my heart rate's up too high. I'll call halfway. legs.
Wow, good. Wow. Four scissors, shuffle. This one feels like a break to me. A lot of walkers this morning. Everyone's kind of staring at my house as they walk by because of the windows open. Here we go. And one, two, four, low. Modify here. Walk, walk. Keep going. I like calling out. Keep going when they're walking by and then they look. <laughs> it's funny. I'm gonna grab a quick sip in between this one. Get low, move, move, move. come on. Okay. Jack front punch, right? Jack double front. Here, boom, 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 boom. Did any of you guys do my uh, leg and plyo workout last week? Wow, that was a good workout. Not to cheat my own horn, but for me, I loved it so much. It was so hard. Sorry, modify here. You need to. Um, but having the leg with that intense cardio jumping, oh, it felt so good afterwards. If you haven't done it, check it out. Just Google Tracy Steen Plyo. I think I only have like two or three workouts like that, so. You'll be able to find it. Punch. It made me like equally cardio sweaty like this one today. Oh, I don't like that. Okay, one and a half rep. Check it out. Squat jump. Ready? Each shoulder width apart. Squat to modify. Down. Pulse. Ooh. Use your hands to help propel you up there, but land with your knees slightly softened, okay? Like you're landing on an egg carton. You don't want to jar your hip or your knee. Shaking. You guys got jello legs yet? A lot of burpee. I'll do one, then I'll show the mod. Here we go. Modify by walking. Out, out, wide, wide. Low squat. I'm gonna take this one slow. On beat. Lay it all the way out into plank. Then you drive your hips forward, powering the body up. Whew. I'm traveling here. Last. 
Oh, horrible. Okay, sprinters, hop. Okay, can we do it? I think so. Maybe not. I'll show you the mod here. Here's your mod. Up, high knee. Okay, touch down, high knee. Jump otherwise. I've been experiencing some issues with a camera, you probably noticed. Oh, switch. It's very frustrating when I turn sideways and then I can't find my face and then it blurs for like a minute and I can't see it when I'm filming, only when I'm all dressed and fresh and editing. So I apologize. I'll still try to talk and tell you what's going on. So even if you can't see it for 30 seconds, you can feel it. Last six seconds here, work hard now, come on. Up, last one. Oh, oh. thank you for being over. Wow, great job you guys. You move daily in your cardio hit workout. Thanks so much for joining me. Make sure you smash that like button. I want like that, this, please. Um, and don't forget to share on your social platforms. A couple of you have been tagging me on Instagram in your workout. You can screenshot this photo and tag me at Move Daily Fitness. Share it on Facebook or on Pinterest. Create a little playlist of your favorite workouts. All right, if you can join me for a stretch, do so. If not, I'll see you guys in the next workout. Uh, uh, pukey pukes. I hope you waited for your heart rate to come down. <clears throat> I'm taking a few minutes here just to bring mine down because you don't want to stop all of a sudden if your blood is still just flowing through the body. You don't want it to pool and then to get that faint feeling. So just keep walking, chilling. If you feel like your heart rate's up too high, Pause the video and join me for the stretch when you're ready. I feel good to go. One foot in front, let's press the heel into the ground. I really want you to focus on lengthening back through that calf that did a lot of work for you today. I'm gonna get really wide here, lean forward. Big stretch right there. Oh yeah, that feels amazing. On this glute, on that calf, on my chest. Mm, that was good, hey? I was dreading it as I often do, and you guys do too, you tell me that sometimes. Okay, switch legs, right leg in front, push the calf in the ground, hinge forward or lean forward, hand and stretch. Did anyone just fall over? <laughs> um, I want to talk to you today about uh, portion control and how important it is uh, to pay attention to that and how much, if you're actually mindful, right, in your everyday portions, how you can reduce, grab your shoelaces, knees together, stretch that ha hamstring, or quad. And you can reduce your caloric intake overall. And by doing so, increasing your mindfulness, you can increase your um, ability to ask yourself and really identify if you're hungry, if you're sad, if you're frustrated, if you're stressed, if you're lonely, if you're bored, right? Um, if you're mindlessly eating, you, you're just gonna pass over all of those signals and likely eat too much. So one of the concepts that I teach my clients is portion control. And there's a really great book by Dr. Brian Wainsink. It's listed in my Amazon links below this video. You can click on the link there. The book is there. It's called Mindless Eating, Why We Eat More Than We Think. And it's true, when you're mindless, you just do. When you eat out of a huge Costco bag, let's stretch up here, stretch it in the torso, glute, chest, um, you're going to consume 30% more, statistics say. Okay. Also, whatever is visible and convenient, you're going to consume more. So if you have a bowl of M&Ms up on your counter, you're going to eat them. Okay, here's case in point. I bought a bag of Costco M&Ms at the beginning of the summer. And um, the first couple days I was pouring them in a bowl. See, just not taking my own advice here. But Piper had her friends over and... You know, every day, multiple times a day, I was walking by there, and it was visible to me, and I stuck my little meat hooks in there, like, <laughs> many times, because I saw it, and I wanted it, so, of course, let's go into a 
glute stretch here. Um, I had put, in the, I put them in a bottom drawer. And then last weekend we had our family reunion. And um, it's funny because probably for one, two, three, four, five, probably for a week, I completely forgot about them. They were in a bottom drawer. I didn't have any on the counter. And I was actually at the store yesterday thinking to myself, I should buy some chocolate covered almonds. And then I saw the M&M peanuts in the bin beside and I'm like, I have those in my house. I can have that as a treat instead. Really good habit. Say, eh? hey, moderation is the key for me. Anyway, um, so it just reiterated the fact and reminded me that if things are visible and convenient, you choose them. So don't make them visible and don't make them convenient for you to pick if they're not healthy. You know, in fact, instead of buying the big Costco size bag of M&Ms, if I was craving it right then and there, I should have bought a small bag, had them, and then they wouldn't be in my house to tempt me, you know, for the rest of the summer. But anyway, that's a, it's a good tip just to remember that don't keep things visible and convenient if it's something that takes you off the path towards health. Also, um, I bought these little yogurts of the day. Uh, I shared this on Instagram. Um, it's a plant-based yogurt made with coconut milk. It's vegan, if that's important to you. Um, I just thought the glass jars were adorable. And look at the size of that. Like, it's teeny tiny. It's portion controlled. It's only 100 calories. They had lots of flavors. They had lemon. This is a raspberry and black currant. You can have it as a little snack with some uh, pumpkin seeds and walnuts or almonds. Um, I put add a little bit of plain Greek yogurt, mix it in, and then you're left with this fun little glass jar that now I'm gonna make a bunch of my chia puddings and put them in there, and that's a perfect teeny tiny portion. And you know what, get a little baby spoon and eat it like that. Well, not a baby spoon, but you know those little teaspoons that mom has, and grandma. I enjoy, I enjoy it like thoroughly. Every day I'm like, I can't wait to have my little glass jar of yogurt, and then I've got to recycle and use these glasses again. Okay, there's your tip of the day. All right, thanks for joining in. I hope you had a great workout. I did, I like sweating with you. Let me know in the comments below what you thought about today's workout, what you would like to see more of, and if you practice portion control and what your best tip is. All right, see you guys in the next workout. If you want more cardio workouts, click or tap the screen right there. If you want my summer playlist, click or tap the screen right there.